My name is Yanar Mohammed. I'm the founder of the Organization of Women's Freedom in Iraq. In the year 2003, we believed that we want a future where women of Iraq can live freely away from violence and protected by the government or by the community. And we started our operation of women's shelters in Iraq. But some extremists in the government did not like the work that we do. So they are trying to dissolve our operations, dissolve our organization, and they filed in a lawsuit against us. Um, we have been protecting women for 20 years, and we will continue to protect them. Since the year 2003, uh, the, uh, there was an intent to have women included in the peace process in Iraq, or rather in the setup of the government, the parliament, the uh, executive parts of the government, but the women that were chosen were not representative of women's rights. They were just uh, supporters of their own political parties and they did not care for women's rights. And even when they did, they were not empowered to bring any difference for women. That's why the civil society needs to be uh, supported needs to be empowered because then it can be the source to give the strong women to the government, the strong women to the parliament who can bring about some change. The international community needs to learn that there is no peace building without women on the tables. When the tables are full of men who hold the guns on the ground, there is no future for that community. You cannot deny half the community from the decision-making and then expect to have a good future.